Hi, my name is Chris Irwin. I work for Bosch Rexroth in the field of linear motion. And in this presentation, I'll show you how to use the website to configure a ball screw and get a drawing off the website. First step is to go to our website, www.boschrexroth.com. On this page, you just go all the way to the right. There's a link called eShop. Click on that. The next step is to go all the way to the left and click on linear motion. On this page, you'll notice that there are uh, links to our other uh, industries as well as product lines. For this presentation, you'll want to focus just on the linear motion. So on the left, like I said, click on the linear motion link. This page shows the variety of product lines that we support on the linear motion. For this example, we're just going to go uh, click on the screw assemblies link, which is right here. Okay, on this next page, you want to click on this link right here, ball screw assemblies. And you want to click on this link right here where it says configurator. This page right here shows the variety of sizes we offer for our ball screw assemblies. Just please note that these sizes will only apply to our ball screw assemblies and not our planetary roller screw assemblies. So for this example, I'm going to choose size 20 ball screw. So as you can see, size 20. Now click on this link right here to continue. Your next page shows the, the types of leads that are offered for a size 20 ball screw. So it's not, some, some will have more than others. This particular one only has four types of leads in relation to that diameter. So for this, for this example, I'm just going to choose a 20 millimeter lead. This page shows a variety of ball nuts that we offer that have a 20 millimeter diameter and a 20 millimeter lead. If you look in our catalog, for certain diameters and lead combinations, you won't see all the types of ball nuts on there. So just consult your catalog to see which diameter and lead goes with which ball nut. For this example, I'm going to choose a cylindrical ball nut, a ZEMES. This page shows the number of circulations offered for the ZEMES size 20 by 20 combination. We offer a two and three turn ball nut for those, two, for those combinations. What you'll need to notice is that each combination has a different load capacity. So the more turns or the more circulations you have in a ball nut, the higher the load capacity. So you'll have to determine which one will be more suitable during your application analysis. For this example, we'll just choose three. Although this isn't very important to what your CAD drawing will look like, um, this shows you at least what kind of seals we offer for our ball nuts. It will also give you information such as the frictional torque for each type of seal. So for this example, I'm going to choose standard seal.